Hi everyone, this is Hibba from My Little Journal and today I'm going to be working in my Currently album. Now if you don't know what my Currently album is, I'm going to add my first uh, layout up at the eye for you to check out. But literally these spreads are going into a separate album and it's all about my currently loving, reading, watching, my favorite photos from the month. I am working on the month of February. I'm kind of behind, but it's not a big deal. I'm pretty good at catching up. So I went ahead and printed out my photos. A lot of these photos of, are from of my favorite things or my favorite photos from the month of February. I will also be um, adding some cards. A lot of these cards, or I think all of these cards are from Kelly Perky and Feed Your Craft. I will be adding all the links for the products I'm using today in this video down in the description box for you. But right now I'm just trying to work this out. I'm going to put my little insert aside and I'm going to start with my 3x4 card which I will use for my currently. I'm going to use my Feminist Scrapbooker currently stamp set. Love the stamp set. It has like currently watching, reading, feeling, loving, just a bunch of little prompts for you to write down your favorites for the month. And I'm just going to grab my pencil or my pen and start filling out these little prompts. I have this picture of my favorite sweater. I think I wore this sweater almost every day in the month of February. It was ridiculous. I just was in love with it. But anyways, I had this 3x4 card backing up my photo that I felt like was really too dark for my photo. So I decided to use this 4x6 card, trim it down to 3x4 and back up my photo with it. That way I have space to add a title and it brightened up my picture. So I'm going to use my puffy alpha stickers to add favorite sweater. And I will also add a little Tim Holtz phrase right above my photo. My daughter and I did a lot of puzzles in the month of February and it's definitely a favorite of mine. So I go through my labels because I want to journal about this little photo. And while I was going through my labels, I found um, this little word strip that said love, love, love like four or five times. So I'm just going to add that right under my currently and then I'm going to go back to my 3x4 photo of my daughter and I doing this puzzle and journal about that on this little label. I don't want to add a lot of layouts to my currently album, so I decided to create a little collage of my favorite photos or favorite moments from the month. Little things like what um, we enjoy doing, my favorite breakfast, or my favorite layout that I created for the month, little things like that. And I just used my Tim Holtz phrase booklet to add some words and phrases to this collage. I'm gonna move on to this three by four card that says February 2018. I believe I cut this out from one of my Studio Calico four by six cards uh, that goes in your little subscription kit to let you know what's coming in your kit. And I just trimmed it to a three by four and I'm using my feature craft a stamp set to stamp out documented and I'm just going to leave it at that. I just feel like when I'm behind I need to go simple because I want to catch up. But moving on to this four by six photo of my beautiful magnolias, I'm also going to be using a Feed Your Craft stamp set. This is the Grow Wild stamp set and I'm going to stamp Grow Wild right on my photo.
The Grow Wild stamp set has these little small flowers and they're so adorable. So I felt like I should be using them and stamping them on this three by four card that said where flowers bloom, so does hope. Just felt like it worked really well. Spring is almost here. I have a photo of some flowers. So I decide to stamp my own little pattern on this three by four card. And then I'm done with this side of my layout. I'm gonna grab my insert now. I have a few more photos to document and um, share, I guess, in my currently album. I'm gonna start by trimming down this four by six card. This is a feature craft uh, four by six card. Um, I trimmed it because my top two are three by fours, so I need to slide them in there. Then I'm moving on to my favorite album for the month of February. I swear I listened to this album over and over again. Um, if you guys don't know who Florence and the Machine are, you should definitely check them out. She's amazing. And I just use my puffy stickers to spell out fave song. And then I'm gonna add one of my puffy hearts right in the center. Uh, staple down my photo and call this little three by four card done. I'm gonna be documenting my favorite game app on my phone and using this three by four card that says one, two, three, four, five. I wanted to use my Amy Tan alpha stickers for this to spell out play across. So that way it would say one, two, three, four, five play. And using these uh, alpha stickers are perfect because they're see-through and you can still see the numbers. So I like that a lot. I will also be adding a little puffy sticker to my photo that says Epic because I love this game. I think I've been playing it for years now. My kids always make fun of me because I'm at some ridiculous stage right now. But this is Farm Heroes and it's a really great entertaining game, by the way. Just gonna be adding some puffy hearts to my little title card and I believe I call my layouts done. As always, I will be adding my little calendar from my Get to Work book, and then I will back it up with my Brandy Kincaid journaling prompts sheet. Love this sheet, her illustrations are amazing, and it's just perfect for my currently album. I do wanna add a little tab to my six by eight pocket, so I'm gonna use my Avery tab and then use two word stickers, back them up, slide them in my tab, and then I call my layouts done. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video, and if you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing, and I hope to see you guys very soon. Bye.